<laughs> I love Wednesday because it is wing day, the day where I shove wings in my face. Dale? Yeah, Ma. I just had a plate of wings over here and now they're missing. Do you have any idea what might have happened to them? I don't know, Mark. Are you sure you left them in here? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. You might want to try we twisting your steps. That always works for me when I lose something, you know. I can still smell them. I've got an empty plate and a mysterious set of footprints going off in this direction. Hmm. The case of the missing wings. So many clues, yet so few answers. Good luck with that one, Mark. Cut the shit, Dale. I know you ate them. Whoa, whoa, now. Wale. <laughs> Don't encourage him! They love it, Mark! It's my catchphrase, Wallace! <laughs> Before you go making wild accusations, I think you should look at the facts. I think you should look in the mirror. <laughs> I know how this looks, Mark. You know, someday we gonna sit on my porch in Tuscaloosa with a couple of sarsaparillas and have ourselves a hooting nanny now. That sounds like a lot of fun, but uh, for now, I think you should take your little white ass to the store and get me some more wings. I'm sorry for your loss, Mark. But you want to know what really happened? Oh, yeah, what really happened? But it's a doozy now, so you might want to relax, have a seat. Uh, yeah. No, you know what keeps standing? Just tell me your stupid story! Oh, okay, now. Todd come into the office earlier and goes, It's a hotter than a devil's taint in July! Turned on the office fan full blast. Papers and props flying every which away. Office supplies shooting at us all at 900 mph, Mark. That's fast. Tom was getting blown around everywhere. He don't weigh more than a buck twenty soaking wet with his clothes on. Your wings flew toward the window. Did I mention the window was open? No. Well, with no regard for my own life, I jumped in front of the open window like Mighty Mouse and caught all ten of your ten wings. I was hanging out the window and I said, Tom, help me up. And he says, toss me the wings first. And would you believe this, Mark? Tom ate your wings. I managed to crawl back up, cause as you know, I'm pretty physically fit. And I said, Tom, what are you doing? And he's like, I hate Mark, and I'm gonna eat his wings. Then I'm gonna go make love to Stasia, who is the wife of Mark. And that's what happened. Wow, that's a fascinating story. Could you tell it again? Cause I'm a little confused about that part in the middle. I don't think I can. I have PTSD, post-traumatic story disorder. Besides, Mark, why are you getting so upset about a bunch of wings that weren't even that good? I mean, that's what Tom said. Aha! So you admit it, you little bastard. Come here! You never catch me, Douglas! I'm pissing out on an empty stomach. I used to one twack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm out like Sequest. Yeah, yeah, yeah! You made me crash the Dale Mobile, boy! If you hurt me, I'll file a grievance with the puppet guild. Oh, I'm not gonna hurt you, Dale. I'm just gonna get you cleaned up, is all. Uh, <laughs> relax, laundry machine! This ain't over, Douglas! Oh, thank you, Mark! I knew you wouldn't let me drown. No, not to drown!